Hey guys, this is a very different kind of video, but I want to talk about my favorite brushes. I have not talked about my favorite brushes ever, so I thought it would be fun to do so. So we'll go through each category and um, I'll tell you about my favorite brushes. So let me grab, some of them might be dirty by the way, let me grab my brush thing. Okay. So for foundation brushes, I just got this brush today, but it is now my new favorite foundation brush. This is the NYX Professional Makeup Number 22 brush. It's like a slanted foundation brush. It is really great because you can use it still to stipple and you can use it to blend too. I mean, it's just really nice, really soft. It's got some denseness to this part, but some looseness up here. It's just great. So this is a really nice brush. I highly recommend it. I mean, I'm in love with this brush. I really, really like it. I used it to blend the foundation today. Um, and I've been having a hard time with liquid foundation, but this brush really helped and it's just, it's definitely, definitely one of my favorite brushes now. Um, other foundation brushes that I like would be uh, the Real Techniques Stippling Brush. I love this brush. It's great. Uh, you can use it for different cream products or just foundation in general. It's just a good, uh, good brush. What else? Oh my gosh, yes. The Expert Face Brush is a great foundation brush. I highly recommend that brush. It is one of their best brushes that Real Techniques has. Uh, and I'm a fan of the buffing brush. I used this a lot today. I used it for like contouring on the forehead. Great, great brush. Um, for like mineral or powder foundations, that's a great brush. So that's all the foundation brushes I'm gonna talk about. Those are my favorite ones. Um, now for powder brushes, my definite favorite is the Real Techniques powder brush. It is huge, it's fluffy, it's amazing. It's just so nice to get the areas with because you can really get them easily with how big this brush is. It is so big and it's just amazing. I love this brush. Um, another really good <clears throat> powder brush is the Multitask Face Brush. You can use this for a lot, but I usually use it for powder. Um, it's just smaller than the other brush, so you know, easier to get it up there and stuff, but really like this powder brush. Uh, let me make sure I'm not getting the dirty brushes mixed up with the clean brushes. Uh, let's see. Eyeshadow brushes. I'm a big fan of these little wet and wild brushes. These are like the little tiny shader brushes. I use these to do um, a coat of the of like a bin eye cream shadow, and I put that down, and I, I use that to stick the shadow too. So it kind of is an extra protection against creasing. And this is what I use to pack that bin eye uh, shadow on. It's really good. These brushes are cheap. They have never shed it on me once and they're literally a dollar. You can get them at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So, great brush. My two favorite eye brushes from Real Techniques um, are the Real Techniques Base Shadow Brush is my favorite brush, and then followed closely by the Deluxe Crease Brush. And for a long time, you could only get them in like the big kits, and so I was having to buy big kits of the brushes to get this base shadow brush, which was my favorite, and then selling the other brushes. But now, I think they sell these two together, which is great. It's how it should have always been. They're phenomenal brushes together. And let's see. For packing color um, onto the lid, you know, like on a cream, on top of a cream shadow, <clears throat> I have this brush. This is from, um, I can't remember the name of that brand. Um, oh, um, Sonia, Sonia, Kosh, 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 so, Sonia, Sonia, oh no. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, Sonia, Sonia Kasich, Kasich? Darn it. But anyway, this is one of the brushes from one of her sets, and this one's nice. This is my favorite one, though. This, again, is a little wet and wild one. It's like the medium-sized shader brush, and that is my favorite one, too put the color down on the lid. Uh, let's see, are there any more brushes I really enjoy? 
Uh, the detailer brush from Real Techniques, I like to use that as an inner corner highlight brush. It's a really good brush. And this is another brush from Sonia Kasich. I think it's how you say it. This I use for the lower lash line a lot. It's just a nice little tiny sponge brush, basically. Um, I think that's all the eyeshadow brushes that are my favorites. Yeah. Now, um, eyebrow brushes. I really like this. <laughs> I just got this. And if you watch my other video, you'll know that I'm in love with it already. This is the Benefit look, a brow brush with a nice, nice spoolie. This is my favorite now. Um, but I also really like the NYX ones. NYX has some, and they're also very nice. And for powder most of the time, I use this Lancome brow brush. And it has like a concealer brush on the bottom. Sorry, Garrett's being crazy downstairs. Um, and then um, for foundation, or not foundation, for concealer, I like this Beach Cosmetics 112 brush. It's nice. It's little and nice. For bigger spots of concealer, I like this Sonia Kasich brush. And that's about it for those brushes. Um, this one gets honorable mention. Oh, it has the the labels even washed off. Uh, this is the Sonia Kasich uh, Tools number 27. This is just a brow brush as well, or an eyeliner brush, but I think it is an eyeliner brush, but I use it for brows sometimes. Um, so that's a nice product too. Let's see. Um, now I just have to do my special uh, brushes for like contouring and stuff. So I have two favorite blush brushes. They're both from Sonia Kasich, and they're from like this flower collection. This pink one I use for bronzer, or I use when I don't want to do super intensely packed um, blush, I'll use this one. If I'm wanting really, really like a hardcore blush look, I use this one. And they're both really nice brushes. I don't know if you can even get them anymore. Um, for contouring, I like this contour brush from Real Techniques. Again, it's just perfect. I like contour brushes like that. Um, for highlighting, I have a bunch of different brushes that I use. But these are my favorite. This is the uh, this is a Sonia Kasich highlight brush. <laughs> this one's really nice. And then I also like the multitask cheek uh, brush from Real Techniques. And sometimes. I use one of the contour ones from Real Techniques. So I really enjoy those a lot. And I don't see any other brushes that I want to mention. Oh, tools, like sponges. Um, so this is going out of stock, but there might still be some left if you want to purchase. Um, so I like the Real Techniques sponge, okay. But this is a sponge from, you see it's got powder on it. This is a sponge from Maestro by Michael Paresh. Parish? Parish? I'm not sure how to say it. I think it's Parish. Um, this was an independent brand that is going, it's, um, it's closing. But you might still be able to buy these. These are the best sponges ever. I'm in love with these sponges. Like, super good sponge, guys. Um, and he's having, like, great deals um, with his closing sale. So, yeah, highly recommend that, that sponge. But those are all of my favorite brushes. Um, I do have some of these little baby ones that I like to take with me sometimes. Um, I like this one for touch-ups. I like this as a little tiny detailing brush around the eyes. Um, but that is all of my favorite brushes. If I had to pick a top two, it would actually be the ones I got today. Um, because I just, they're so good. It would be the NYX um, like slanted foundation brush and the Benefit brow brush. Definitely, definitely great, great brushes. So um, I have a mixture of brushes here. I have NYX brushes, I have Real Techniques, I have some, some high-end ones like Lancome. Uh, I have a big mixture. So don't ever think that you need to own just like really expensive professional brushes. You can get brushes here and there and you will you will end up eventually narrowing it down to your favorite brushes. I love all the brushes that I have. I have way more brushes than the ones that I even mentioned. I just, 
the, um, the ones I mentioned are my absolute favorite brushes. So that's everything, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and this is Megan Holtz out.